Hi, Debbie Chu here from Chu on Vegan and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm going to be making a nice little topping for your tacos. You can put it in your burritos, baked potatoes. It's something really simple, a little spicy, and uh, I think you're going to like it. So this dish is very reminiscent if you've ever had the corn on the cob where they put the spicy mayo and the Parmesan cheese. It's similar to that. So what I did is I started out with some very finely shredded romaine lettuce. I defrosted about mm, three-fourths cup to a cup of roasted um, organic corn. And I'm just gonna th throw that in here. And then I also have a finely chopped red onion. I used my little chopper here to get a really fine chop. And this is probably mm, maybe a half an onion. I'm going to add about a quarter teaspoon of garlic, granulated garlic, some pepper. Next I'm going to add about three tablespoons of the Just Mayo Chipotle flavor. It gives it a nice little kick. So we're going to um, give this a stir first. Then we'll add our mayo. Once you get everything all combined, then you're gonna add a little sprinkle of some vegan Parmesan cheese, whatever kind you'd like. A little sprinkle here. And then stir it up again. And then you're ready to top whatever you'd like. This is also good on its own too, just alone. So I think I'm gonna put mine on a little taco. So I just warmed up a tortilla with a little vegan cheese, a little homemade refried beans, and then I'm just going to top it with this delicious mixture here. And I topped it with a little bit of salsa. So it looks really pretty. So let's give this a try. It's gonna be a mouthful. Mmm, 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 mmm. You've got the kick from the chipotle mayo, you've got the crunch of the onion and the corn and then the lettuce is just so refreshing. So give this one a try. It's good for you, it's good for the animals, and it's good for the planet. And what you put on your plate determines your fate. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Until next time, thank you.